Welcome, welcome, welcome. For today's reading, I will be using the Easy Tarot. Welcome, everybody. Thank you for returning to my channel. Thank you for liking, sharing and subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate all your love and support. Today's reading will be a Celtic Cross. When you are new to the channel, please be welcome. Look if this reading resonates. It is a general collective reading, so take what does and leave what doesn't. But it helps when you subscribe to the channel because then you are energetically connected with my channel. And I'm a channeler, so sooner or later uh, I will also pick up on your energy and the readings will resonate more and more. What do we need to know for today's reading? First of all, I'm going to start by channeling the most important messages that we need to know for today's collective. Okay, the Salunite. I have to use the Salunite. Okay. I feel that you are no longer afraid. Maybe you are no longer afraid to speak up or to do something or to confront somebody. I feel you are no longer afraid to confront somebody. Can be that uh, before you were a bit of a person that um, was liked by everybody um, and was concerned about confronting somebody if you didn't like what they did or what they said. But there is no hesitation anymore. I think that um, you know now what you want, what you stand for, what you like and what you don't like. I think that you have grown up and that you know what your morals are and it can be that um, there will come a discussion or a conflict on your way. And you will speak up, you will act up, you will confront somebody, maybe on their attitude or maybe on their wrongdoing or maybe on how they have treated you in the past, because now you um, are not afraid anymore. You are standing your ground, you have your self-respect, you are confident and... Um, And that's why this situation or this confrontation is coming out of nowhere. But I think it will uh, give you the chance to, to speak up for yourself and to release everything that... Uh, was bothering about this person or the situation or how they treated you and um, after that I think you can close this chapter for good that's what I'm feeling okay a below the deck what do we have we have the four of cups can be that somebody has always denied you or you will never uh, good enough in um, at work or maybe in a, a friendship circle you felt never good enough this this person uh, belittled you made fun of you um, criticized you behind your back I hear and it was a snake in the grass it was a rat if you know what I mean and you 
never felt accepted in this community or in this friendships uh, group or in this uh, team at your work but you had the feeling that you had no choice that you had to go with it and stand and stand up but you couldn't stand up you were too afraid um, of this person maybe they had a lot of influence maybe they were your boss or your manager or whoever it was you felt um, not good enough you felt um, they, ma they made you feel smaller than you were so can be that this person was critical to you criticizing you uh, you were never enough um, that sort of energy i feel can be that uh, this person uh, will contact you can be that this person now uh, changed their mind and want to apologize for their actions, for what they said. I feel strongly that the roles are reversed now, that they are afraid of you because look at this, they are all covered up in... Uh, this harness and they feel the need to apologize i think this person is afraid of you or is afraid about the fact how you are going to react to them because they know that they treated you very very wrong that they belittled you that they made fun of you that they never were a true friend, but a backstabbing frenemy or a backstabbing colleague. And um, they feel in the cold because um, I feel strongly that they got somehow, some way their karma. And now they feel this urge to come back and apologize and accept they hope that you will accept their apology so this karma will go away i hear can be that you are dealing with a cancerian or you have strong cancerian in your chart this person cannot move forward they are getting obstacle after obstacle it can also be that they have a lot of car or transportation troubles um, this person um, is not growing is not um, getting anywhere because uh, whatever they do it will not be successful of how they treated you and they come to this uh, sudden realization that they have mistreated you. So they get the epiphany that they have to make their wrongs right. So it can be that they are coming in with a confession or maybe with an apo um, apo um, apology because um, they have enough uh, of these tower moments after tower moments if you see this tower there is only one person falling out and that's th that is the person that i am talking about so um they see that you are very kind very loving and it can be that this is a case of um taking advantage of your uh, kind, kind and loving heart. 
they see that you still are very kind and very warm to others. And it can be that um, they see now that they made a mistake. Can be that this is a soulmate, can also be a karmic soulmate, of course. They see something different in your energy now. Can be because they um, went through this epiphany. Can be because of the fact that they had tower moment after tower moment. But can also be that they got wiser and that they know now um, what a true friend is. Can be that um, you are so busy with uh, whatever you do that you don't see this ap apologize uh, coming in or you don't see this person coming to your doorstep or phoning you or contacting you because uh, it is done it is over for you you don't have any contact with them anymore and you have moved on this person did not this person was still following you somehow some way can be that um, they asked frequently about you maybe you were not in certain places so they asked uh, mutual friends maybe even looked you up on social media to get um, a clearer picture of how you are doing now and what uh, interests you have at this moment and if you are busy I think this person wants to mend with you wants to apologize for their wrongdoing can be that uh, this will catch you off guard that you are surprised maybe even um, that uh, you are thinking why why now or why uh, didn't they accept me before I think that uh, this person needed some time with the Seven of Pentacles to realize this, to see this, and that they are not as fast in growing in understanding like you are. So they needed their time, but now they see what they did wrong and they want to apologize about it and if you are open to it mending the situation thank you for watching till next time namaste